This is the team. Dr. Michael Oaken introduces the team that will lead a new research center at the University of Florida. The center will work on finding a cure for dystonia, a disabling brain disorder that affects a half million Americans. To make some headway on dystonia, we need to develop dystonia researchers. We need to get more people interested in the field. We need to train them. We need to make them great. We need to make them better than we are. And we need to send them out into the world so they can do good. A $1 million gift was made by the Tyler's Hope Foundation to help fund the new research center. Richard Staub started Tyler's Hope because his son Tyler suffers from the debilitating movement disorder. Richard gave the gift to UF researchers because he thinks they can find a cure for the disease. We were very familiar with the doctors, you know, we think we know that their reputations and, and everything that the, the facilities that they have are, are some of the top in the world, so uh, we wanted to see if we could add to that. The gift will help newly recruited faculty member and leading dystonia researcher Dr. Yu King Lee advance his clinical testing of new therapies for dystonia. UF researchers are excited to have Dr. Lee on their team. It's just absolutely huge. It's hard for me to describe in words how to get somebody here of that um, magnitude and uh, you know it's it's just it, it it's it's going to rock the whole dystonia world having them here. The new research center will soon start testing a drug in clinical trials that may treat people who suffer from dystonia like Tyler. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Bilowich.